YouTube channel. Now in this video, we are going to cover another modify command, which is scale. Now scale is a very useful command, uh, basically which is used to reduce or enlarge the size of a particular object. So in order to understand this, I'm going to uh, open an existing drawing. So uh, this video related to this practice drawing, I have already uploaded on YouTube. You can watch it, how to draw a spanner. Now we are going to learn how can we uh, adjust the size of this particular uh, image. Okay, so scale, as I told you, this is available in modify toolbar. So you'll go to modify toolbar and you will click on scale or you can type scale as well. Now, as soon as you click on scale, your command bar will show that the active command is scale and in the guideline, it will ask you to select objects. Now I'm going to select the object okay now instead of dimensions i'm uh, all instead of all the dimensions i'm simply going to select the spanner okay there are certain dimensions selected but uh, what i want to explain you will uh, get in a very short duration now as soon as you click on uh, as as soon as you select all the objects press enter now just take a look at the command bar it will ask you to specify a base point now i'm specifying this point as the base point and then it will ask you to specify the scale factor. Now scale factor is the factor by which you want to increase or decrease the size. Okay, suppose that you want uh, the drawing to be double of its actual size. So you will use a scale factor of two. Okay, if you want half of the actual size, you will uh, type 0.5 and then enter. So it will change. Otherwise, another option is you can basically uh, move, from the base point the farther you move basically the size will increase okay if you will move away from the base point the size will increase if you will move closer to the base point the size will reduce now suppose that this is the size that i have taken scale factor now take a look along with that same scale factor what has happened all the dimensions are increased okay so this is something that you need to understand if you are using scale command by default what will happen all the dimensions all the curve dimensions that you have given they will increase okay so that is something that you need to understand now i'm pressing ctrl z and take a look these dimensions are increased but there are certain dimensions which are not increased like uh, use scale specify a scale uh, base point as this one and specify scale factor as 2 now take a look this 6 has not changed 2 has not changed this one has not changed okay so why these dimensions are same so we are going to understand it so simply press ctrl z again we are at the same location now i'm going to select all of them and now i'm going to select scale what will happen now this time these dimensions are increasing the reason was that to place these dimensions we have simply selected two center points okay uh, basically center for circles or curves so if we are increasing the scale of this complete drawing their centers are almost stationary due to which these dimensions they were not increasing okay so if you select all of them if you select these uh, options as well and uh, if you sp uh, specify a base point as any of these points these dimensions they will increase so i hope everything is clear related to this scale command we are also going to take a look at uh, what are the other options that are available in the command bar so i'm just pressing ctrl z here okay so this is our original drawing select all of them go to scale specify a base point i'm specifying base point as the same uh, any point outside it now just take a look we have uh, two options here if you click on copy basically our original uh, diagram that we have it's uh, remaining at the same location and we are creating a new copy of the same image okay so that's the meaning of copy here i hope uh, you guys have learned something new and if you enjoyed the video do share and like it thank you very much and have a nice day mm -hmm.